Juice TV Superhero Awards are proudly supported by Q Super. Hi guys, my name is Mackenzie and today I really want to shine some spotlight on one of my superheroes. I've known this legend for around 10 years now and he's helped me through so much, through thick and thin. He's always so, so supportive. I've been coming to this hospital since I was two years old because I was born with cerebral palsy. I have such a supportive team who has helped me throughout all my challenges I've faced over the years. And I have one very special person in my team who means the world to me. The winner of Juice TV's Round 6 Superhero Awards is Mackenzie's physiotherapist, Tim. He has been an integral support to Mackenzie and her family for the past decade of her hospital journey. And here's the man of the hour, Tim. <laughs> Thanks, Mackie. It's good to be here. I'm glad you're here with me. <laughs> well, look, it's been a privilege to be nominated for this uh, for this award. Mind you, he didn't know I was nominating him. I did not. It's been a tough six months. Yeah. It's certainly been, you know, surgical pain, Lots. you know, weakness after the surgery that we've had to work through together. Yeah. But, you know, I guess we're three months from... Achieving my goal, yeah. Your goal. Yes. And what's your goal? To walk in high heels, the wonderful shirts that we're wearing. Yeah. Yes. Wheels to heels. 2020. I get to be the team physio. I get to be me. <laughs> and then we've got we've got a team nurse. And a team doc, two team doctors two team actually. Doctors. And they've all got shirts too, so I've got like a whole team yep. behind me. So guys, I don't know if you've noticed already, but we're kind of twinning me and Tim today. And I just wanted to get Tim's thoughts on how he feels about wearing the shirt. Well look, I'm just glad that it's um, black with a little bit of pink. So how did you come to end up with these shirts? Um, I just wanted a physical reminder of my dream and my goal and wearing it's just a constant reminder that I will achieve my dream and to walk in high heels and yeah, it's just exciting to wear it. Your mum doesn't have one but... She deserves one. Though. She deserves one. Yeah. Well, your whole family really. Yeah, Sebastian and Coda rock pink as well. And they're regularly at your appointments? Yes, Coda they are. Seb they're very entertaining to watch. And they help to keep you motivated with your therapy, but they also help you at home when you're needing extra support. They do. They're like, turn your leg out or like, like you can do it. They're a good reminder. They are. Big thanks to my bros and my big sister for helping me on this journey. So I know it was a little while ago, but Tim, do you remember our first session? I think you'll have to remind me. Um, well, I was very tiny back then. You were and, very tiny. And Still you're... in pink, but very tiny. <laughs> yes, but um, I remember we were at the old children's hospital and we were doing boxing. Like you had your boxing gloves and I was punching your boxing gloves. And that was just after my osteotomies. After your osteotomies. I think one of the, the early sessions that I remember, um, Dad was with you and we were doing some serial casting after one of your, your episodes of Botox. It's been a long time time since then. Yeah, definitely a long time. And it's been five years since since we started together at this hospital and uh, you know we've been through six surgeries let alone all of the other interventions. Yes, we've gotten through it all. I just wanted to congratulate you, Tim. You're so, so deserving of this award and you're definitely my superhero and such a legend of a person. And I couldn't be more happier that you were the recipient of this award. Thanks, Mackie. Um, but, you know, I mean, it's really, you know, I'm, I'm one professional amongst a big team that's been supporting you. The nurses, the doctors, both from rehab and orthopedic department. The pain team's been involved, the dietitian social worker, allied health assistant. There's a lot of people that have really got Mackenzie to this point, but you know, I'm, I'm just proud to have been part of your journey, part of your family's journey, and I guess, you know, to be part of a team that's able to, to provide the support that you've needed after your surgery. 